guys so today we're gonna learn chapter 2 atoms molecules and ions these are the subtopic in this chapter and we're going to focus on 2.1 proton number nuclear number and isotope so at the end of this topic you should be able to describe the subatomic particles define proton number nuclear number and isotope as well as writing isotope notation so atom consists of three subatomic particles namely electron which freely move around the nucleus and also inside the nucleus we have two other subatomic particles which is proton and also neutron so in detail electrons in terms of mass electron is the lightest one because they have 9.1 exponent negative 28 grams very light while proton and neutron has the same mass but in terms of charge both electron and proton have the same charge with different sign, opposite sign, negative for electron and positive for proton, while neutron has no charge at all. Now, proton number and nuclear number. Proton number is the number of proton in the nucleus of an atom, also known as the atomic number. Nuclear number is the total number of protons and neutrons in the nucleus of an atom, also known as the mass number. The symbols Z and A respectively. Moving on, isotope is two or more atoms with the same number of protons but different number of neutrons. They have the same chemical properties but different physical properties. Alright, so let's have a look at the example of isotope. Sodium for example can exist as sodium 23 or sodium 22 but both of these sodium has the same number of protons which is 11 okay but different number of neutron and a 23 has 12 protons oh sorry 12 neutrons but na 22 has 11 neutrons now let's have a look at isotopes of hydrogen hydrogen they have three different isotopes hydrogen 1 hydrogen 2 and hydrogen 3 Hydrogen 1 is also known as protium, hydrogen 2 is known as deuterium, while hydrogen 3 is known as tritium. And all of these three hydrogen has the same number of protons, they all have one proton. But hydrogen 1 has no neutrons, zero neutron because 1 minus 1 is zero. Hydrogen 2 or deuterium has one neutron because 2 minus 1 is equals to 1. And hydrogen 3 has two neutrons because 3 minus 1 is equal to 2. Now let me just remind you that proton plus neutron is equals to nucleon number. So if you want to find neutrons, you just have to minus nucleon number minus proton number, then you will get neutron. Now let's learn isotope notation guys. Isotope notation can be written in the form of ions or atom. Both have X as the symbol of element, A is the nuclear number, and Z is the proton number. Special for X, there must be other charge di sebelah kanan atas sana. Depends on berapa charge dia lah. For example, isotope notation for mercury, Hg, 20280. Bermaksud, Hg has 80 protons, 1, 2, 2 neutrons sebab 2, 0, 2 minus 80 so dapatlah 1, 2, 2 and elektron dia adalah 80 same as proton because they are neutral tiada charge di sana kan tapi kalau di ion Hg2 plus proton dia sama 80 neutron dia pun sama 1, 2, 2 tetapi dia punya elektron minus 2 sebab dia sudah jadi plus 2 di sana try this guys so write the isotope notation for magnesium 23, 24, and 25 respectively. So, semua ni adalah atom. Simbol dia Mg. Mg, proton number dia 12. Jadi, Mg 12. And then, dia punya neutron, a nuclear number, sorry, 23. Kalau magnesium 23. Kalau magnesium 24, 12. And then, 24. Kalau magnesium 25, Mg, 12, 25. Semua tiada charge kan? Semua neutral. Okay, macam mana kalau dia ada charge? Magnesium ion. Magnesium ion ni biasanya dia punya charge yang paling common lah. Ah. Magnesium dia punya charge adalah 2 plus. Sebab dia bawang 2 elektron kalau menjadi stabil lah. Jadi, kalau let's say lah Mg2312 tadi. Kalau dia jadi ion, dia akan jadi Mg2 plus 12, 23. 
Begitulah cara kita tulis. Thank you. Hope you enjoy.